Hey guys, my name is Henry, and here is the well-awaited part two to batch coating. So today we're just going to be going over Chocolatey. So Chocolatey is a um, basically apt dash git type software for Windows. So I'm just going to go over the installation of Chocolatey. So Chocolatey, Chocolatey can be used to install programs that are useful, like CC Cleaner, Malwarebytes, Avast, or if you use some other trash um, antivirus software. So to get started, it's really easy. All you do is copy this under the chocolatey.org uh, forward slash install. Then you're gonna go over to CMD, right click this, and then hit run as administrator. And then you just get paste this in and hit enter. So now it's just installing the latest version of Chocolatey. Pretty self-explanatory, I'll skip it when it's done. Okay, so it's done. Now time to generate demonstrate what chocolate you can do. Chocolate is pretty diverse on what you can install on it. If you want to see what you can install, you just go up here, click packages, and it shows all the things you can install, Google Chrome, Firefox, Flash Player, Java. Um, so say if I wanted to install Chromium. So I'll just go up here, search for Chrome, and Chromium. So here's the command. You're just gonna type in Choco, install chromium then it's gonna ask if you want to install it okay that was weird for some reason the chromium patch package was broken so once you i'm just gonna do flash player for example you just do choco install flash player active x for adobe flash player active x and then it's gonna ask do you want to run the script and you're just gonna type in y and it's gonna install the program right there and then now i have flash player on it now I have Flash Player on my computer. Say so if you didn't want it, the program, you could just do Choco, uninstall, Flash Player, Active X. If I could spell it correctly. There you go. Now it's going to ask if I want to uninstall the package. And then you're just going to click yes through that. So, um, so now you might be asking, well, can it be used in scripts? And of course it can. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is you wanna go back to home and then uh, install. And then right at the old, at, right at the other script we had, you just get put this right at the beginning to install a chocolate. There you go. Now when you run the script, it'll install chocolate and get it ready. So now say if you wanted it to install Malwarebytes, you just do REM Choco install and then you're going to want to look up what the package name is for Malwarebytes. Which is just Malwarebytes, so it's simple enough. And then you're going to do dash Y. So with the dash Y, that means it just automatically, you, that means you don't have to do anything. It automatically accepts the licenses and agreements. So that's just a quick tutorial on how to use Chocolatey. It can be used, it's mainly used just to install programs. It can't uninstall already, it can't uninstall programs that weren't installed by Chocolatey. It's just kind of weird like that. But anyway, thank you for watching and stay tuned for episode three. And I believe we'll be going over um, audit policies and local security policy.